Oh god. <gasps> Shut up. <laughs>
Okay, ready. Okay, going forward. Ready, let's go. Woo! <laughs> yes, I'm ready. Yes, I'm ready. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I have never used detect thoughts. And I really feel like I should take advantage of that. But expect hostility if you're caught prying. Ooh. I feel like I should take advantage of that. Like, do you cast detect thoughts, like, before talking to someone? And then you can, like, hear their thoughts while you're talking to them? Or, like, can you just, like... The plot thickens? Ooh. Or can you just, like, detect thoughts when you're not talking to them? Like, from a distance? If you don't roll well, maybe. <gasps> Where are we? I'm so excited. So we're still kind of in the Grim Forge, it looks like. But, like, leaving... Looks like there's light up that way. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited right now. I can't even contain myself. I don't even want to move. I don't even want to move. I just want to take it all in. Where are we? We're still underground. Okay, what does this plaque say? We offer our prayers to the Dark Lady, whose comfort and grace heals all. That is not Zendra's voice. I need to change that. I just don't feel like that voice fits her. I should have done that. I can't. So this is where we just came up in. Yes, okay. Elevator to the Underdark. So we can go back. It looks like we can go back to the Underdark, though. Like, whatever. <clears throat> okay. We offer our pain to the Lady of Loss, that she may truly know her faithful. I feel like we're really getting into Dark Justicia shit. We're getting into Char... Char shit. Shadowheart Char shit. We offer ourselves to the darkness, that blessed Shah may give us her mercy. Ooh. Okay. I can't, why? Oh, I don't have any available. <gasps> can I break it open? Can I, can I, can I break it open? Hold on, oh, there we go. Is that a thing? Okay. <clears throat> do I ruin things if I do that? Do I ruin what's on the inside? Is that... Have I been able to just, like, bust things open this whole time? Uh, Shadowheart? Excuse me. No. Okay, hold on. I just wanna... You don't ruin the content. I'm just gonna... Uh... Huh. Why? I think that it was... Okay, hold on. We're just gonna we're gonna Never continue trying this. Excuse me, Lizelle. Or if I do like this, level one. Spell. I'm wasting a spell slot on this. Tormento. Ugh, for Dom. Ah! I can't hold it any longer. What happened? Trigger random magical effect at the start of each turn. I want to go in there. No, how do I not have thieves' tools? I should have bought some. I didn't even think about it. Oh, I'm upset. Oh, I'm upset. Hold on, I'm going up this way first. I don't know why. You attack things in front of people, they get mad, but here is totally fine. I don't know how to get break it. I don't think I have anything that can break it. Because this doesn't work. My cantrips don't work. <clears throat> medium toughness. What does that mean? What do I need to get past medium toughness? This? Fireball? I'm using all my spells on this freaking thing. Hey, that worked, though. <laughs> Dodger wave! Oh, hold on. <laughs> you have Carlac. Send the whole thing to camp. Oh, that's true. I could do that. I just wasted so many spell slots. Hold on. I'm reloading. 22 damage for medium toughness. I didn't want to waste my spell slots. Sorry. I'm reloading. And then I'm going to send the whole thing to camp. And then maybe I'll get it later. Uh, can I take it? I can't! I can't. Too heavy. Uh, Lazel can take it. Can you take this? Pick up and add to wares. <laughs> I love that she could just carry a whole chest. <laughs> and just carry it around. That's cute. Um, it's not, it's right here. Right? Can I put this in camp? Yay! Okay, cool. We have everything that's in there. And we'll have, go back to camp. <laughs> It'd be great if there was just potatoes in the chest. I'd be so mad if there's like nothing actually good in there. 
Um, I bet Asterion has some uh, tools. Ooh, what is this? What? Oh, oh, there's a wizard! There's a freaking wizard right here! What do you mean? What are you doing? Why are you di Why are you here? Hello? There's a freaking wizard just chilling in here. Look at this dude. Who there, wanderer? I love you. It's Gandalf. Stay thy course a moment to indulge an old man. Elminster? What? The very same, Gale. What? And a fair bit miffed he is, too. Finding himself forced to expose his best pair of boots to so many miles of country road on your behalf. They know... Wait, do... do, do what? Do they know each other? Hit that country road, old man. I'm not interested in the drunk you saw. Hold on. Many miles, you say? Where do you hail from? I think some proper introductions are in order. Meet Elminster Ormar. A good friend of mine, but rather more significantly, he's the most famed and respected wizard in the realms. Why are you chilling down here? What Am are you doing? I indeed. Most famed and respected errand boy, more like. <laughs> I was bid to spare neither time nor my own self to find you. She sent me, Gale. You know of whom I speak. He but came why? to find Gale? Out with it, Elminster. Please. Young man, has your sojourn away from Waterdeep washed away your decorum as well as your patience? Nigh a ten day I've gone without honest fare, worthy of the name, drank naught, but what the sky entitled my thirst. Why, some bread, cheese, and a cup of wine would appear unto me a feast. Surely you won't begrudge me a mite of rest and repast before I get out with it. Bro, well, I mean, we need to we need to figure out what you want. I suppose we could part with a few of our rations. Um, where is your decorum? Yes, Gail, where is your decorum? I'm not in the habit of taking. Okay, I suppose we could we could part with a few of our rations. Sure. And a great kindness that would be. See, Gail. Even in these barren parts, the art of hospitality begets inspired new works. If only one keeps up the practice. <laughs> oh, for the love of... <laughs> uh, this way, then. Hmm. To your camp. You're just inviting oh, yourself to camp, okay. Dawdle now, lad. You're the one who's in such a frightful hurry. Are we just going back to camp? Oh, on 13 centuries old, and he still thinks with his stomach. <laughs> We'd best follow. And see if he's more disposed to speak plainly once it's stopped its grumbling. Okay, very well. I suppose I'm as curious as you are to hear what he has to say. Okay, sounds good. A wise choice. Better to indulge your curiosity than Elminster's appetite. <laughs> That's so funny. We're just going right back to camp. Because <clears throat> some dude came up and he's like, Hey, Gail, take me to your camp and feed me. <laughs> mm, yes, what a delightful wedge of old as Turin that was. Doesn't do to parlay on an empty stomach, you know. Makes one's words frivolous when they should be grave. Plenty to digest, after all. A good deal to stew over, if you will. Words ladled with import should be savored so as to better absorb their meaning. Wouldn't you agree? Alminster. <laughs> right. Um, I love this. You see... I, um, oh my god. Um, well, that is to say. Oh my god. Gail, my boy, I've come to address a most pressing matter. Oh, geez. I'll speak as plainly as I can, forswearing the accustomed frills that decorate my speech. Yes. There's a lot of I'm it. here on behalf of Mistra. Oh, geez. The message and the charge I bring you are hers. Huh, okay. Oh, um, you were sent here as an actual divine messenger. I'm surprised she sent you in the first place after Gail's debacle. Um, what message and what charge would that be? Speak fast then. Let's do, I'm surprised she sent you here in the first place after Gail's debacle. And like, <laughs> looks at Gail. I feel like that's what she would do. Thank you for that most <laughs> considerate reminder. 
You know where you went wrong, Gail. Oh, that's funny. No, we needn't dwell on that here and now. But even so, you're to be given a chance of redemption. Okay. Mistral would consider forgiveness. She would consider what she considers to be forgiveness. <laughs> That's a good way to put it. Mistral is aware of the misadventures that have befallen you both. She knows of your strife with the absolute. That most insidious of evils. Okay. Um, if the goddess herself is aware, I wouldn't say no to some divine intervention. Um, if even the gods know, why are we facing these threats alone? Oh, that's a good question. Um, you wouldn't have to know, happen to know of a cure, would you? Some all-powerful parasite withering spell, perhaps? I kind of want to know this one. Why are we facing this alone? They choose the instruments of their will with great precision. Sometimes the single drops we think we are do not realize what waves we are building up to be. Can we stop speaking in do metaphors? Do not discount yourself. Uh -huh. And by the same token, do not discount your enemy. So the gods think we're powerful you as fuck? Is that what you're saying? That the absolute is more dangerous than you can possibly conceive. Oh, jeez. It threatens all who live, even those who are undying. It threatens the gods, the weave, the very fabric of the universe itself. What creature was that, that in the why background? I have come here to charge you, Gail, with its destruction. What? It is Mistress Belief that only you can. Ooh. Gail, look how powerful people think you are. Gail alone? How so? Mistress mistaken, I will be the absolute destroyer. Hogwash. I have beliefs and false hopes. Um, Gail alone? How so? The orb. Precisely. Do they want you to detonate? Mistress has granted me the power to stop the clock, as it were, on the orb's rush to overpower you. Instead... You will be able to Ooh. its lethal combustion at will. Ooh, shit. Interesting. This could be hell or hindrance. We shall have to see. Ooh. You must find the heart of the absolute, whatever that may be, and use yourself as the um, catalyst that will burn it from this world wait. wait oh yeah okay no just okay i get what they mean i thought he meant that he could just like use it and still be fine but they mean like you can detonate at will you can detonate yourself at will so like we want Mis what mistra wants gail to go up in there and explode himself are you serious she wants him to go in there and like sacrifice himself. What? Mr. Spiteful. Th what the heck? That's so horrible. That's monstrous. You're tasking him to kill himself. Say what you will, but you can't force Gale to go through with this. Um, I'm saying that's monstrous. We'll be rid of both the Absolute and Gale in one fell swoop. <gasps> oh, that's horrible. I'm going to say that's monstrous. He is not. But it seems that Mistra is. Yeah, what the hell? It brings me no pleasure saying this, my friend. But such is Mistra's will. Yours must be the sacrifice that will undo the absolute. No. And for your sacrifice, you will be redeemed. In death. Such is Mistra's promise. With that, I've said my sorry piece. I need only bestow unto thee the charm I was bid. I am so mad at Mistra, actually. So he is now... It is done. Both charge and charm have been committed into your care. To you, I commit into care Gale himself. I count on you to shepherd him well on this strangest of journeys. Brosif. 
There's a long journey ahead. We'll find another way. <clears throat> I'm going to do that. Okay, yeah. Right. I kind of need to shepherd him while on this. <clears throat> Sorry. Strangest of journeys. Um, yeah. There's a long... There's still a long journey ahead. We'll find another way. Or some other fortune altogether. Like moons make swell and wane the nescient seas. So too... The skies truven gods ordain the tidal fates of mortal days. Okay. And yet, a notion born in lonely hours. Come, ebb, come, flow, come. All that is beyond the breadth of our dominion. Be a moon unto yourself. Even the waves of fate can break upon the shores of will. Farewell, okay. my friend. <laughs> Farewell, Elminster. I'm glad she chose you. Oh, boy. Oh, I spit. I was like, oh, boy. <laughs> I, I was so distraught. I spit everywhere. Um, Horrible. So now Gale is not a ticking time bomb. He is a just a regular grenade that we can pull the thing out whenever. But I'm not gonna let that happen. Sandra's not gonna let that happen. A remote time bomb, there you go, that one. That's what I was looking for. Um, okay, ready? Okay, so we just went through some crazy shit. Um, Gail's probably so fucked up right now, mentally. Um, hold on, let me see if I can, before I do that, we'll just give him some time. We'll just give Gail a minute <laughs> to process that. Um, please tell me that chest. Yes. Take, pick up. Um, can I put this? Oh, shit. Okay. I'm just kidding. Um, can you come Action, here? Can you come help me? <laughs> Please. I need you to get this. And take it. Okay. And then I need you to put it on the ground. Can I do that? Place in world. Put it on the ground, right there. Okay, thank you. And then, um, All right. and what then I think I have access to if Asterion has thieves tools. Wait, do I? Asterion, give me your thieves tools. I don't think he has any. <gasps> Nobody has any. Well, if I keep the chest just sit in there, will it stay there for when I get thieves tools? I'll just sit there. Even when I leave camp and come back, this will still be here. Side note, this is a, it is a super cool camp. I'm, I'm really excited. I'm looking around. I'm going to. I love this camp. This is amazing. All right. We're going to talk to Gail first, and then we'll talk to everyone else. I feel like they'll have something to say, probably, about what just happened. Um, what is up here? What is back here? Hello? Oh, of course it's Withers. Look at you. Look at you in your little spot. You really wanted to be alone up here this time? in this camp and not be in a man cave. This is a really big camp. What are you doing over here? Look, you got your own tent and stuff. Cute. Love, this is a huge camp. <laughs> Whoa. What in the world? I wonder if it's, I wonder if the camps are gonna be bigger now. Um, be, what in the shit? This is giant. What are you talking about? This is so cool. I wonder if the camps are gonna be bigger because we might get more companions in act two. So maybe like the camps now, wherever we go, are gonna be a lot larger. Um, should I change her voice? I'm not gonna do that right now, I'm just kidding. I don't feel like doing that. Uh, this is huge though. Where's Halson? This is like a whole, we got like a whole civilization going on. <laughs> it's not just a camp. You got like a whole town. Did I miss Halson? Oh, he has a camp now. Halson can be on our team now? Question mark. Okay, sorry. I Okay, let's go talk to Gale first. See what he has to say. And then we'll go talk to everybody else. So we're going to spend a little bit of time in camp right now. Look at the voice. Because earlier the narrator was talking and I thought it was, and you thought it was you. You might need to listen to it once more. Oh. Yeah, no, yeah, no, yes, no. The, I think it was 
her, because when she talks, the words are above her head. Or, or does the narrator narrate the plaques that I read? I always thought it was her. I always thought it was Zendra that reads out the plaques. Okay, ready, Gail? Let's see what you got to say. Are you okay? An audience with Elminster is never less than memorable. I'd have hoped to introduce you to him in less dire circumstances. But those are hard to come by these days. Um, okay, I've always imagined Elminster to be more imposing. Did I, do I know who he is? Did Gail tell me about him before? I forgot. Um, an old man with a craving for cheese. Hardly the great wizard of le legend. He didn't seem much a friend showing up and demanding you to kill yourself. Uh, actually, I was hoping to talk about something else. Um, I'd always imagine Elminster to be more imposing. Let's see. I, I think Zendra would say, an old man with a craving for cheese. Hardly the great wizard of legend. A wizard doesn't reach <laughs> Elminster's age without enjoying their home comforts. <laughs> Those who seek danger over cheese don't tend to live as long. <laughs> For Mistra to have sent him. The severity of her bidding could not be clearer or weigh more heavily on me. Time seems so infinite when you're young. Aww. A month is an age. A year is a lifetime. It is a strange feeling to realize how little of it one might have left. Damn, that just hit hard. Um, you're seriously considering doing what Elminster said? Of course. We offer the clearest solution to our problem. All I have to do is find the right place and time, close my eyes, and let go. Stop, I'm gonna cry. Then the slate will be clean. Wrongs will be righted, the absolute will be gone, and I along with it. No! Um, I don't understand. Can't Mr. just destroy the absolute or Elminster himself? So that's it? You on a suicide mission now? Mission now? There's surely another way. What about me? Am I safe around you? Um, I don't understand. Can't Mintra, Minstra just destroy? That was hard. To, can't Minstra just destroy? <laughs> That's hard to say. The absolute or Alminster himself. I've no doubt she has the power to do so, but as for the permission, Ao would not look kindly on her meddling in mortal affairs. Ugh. Divine intervention has a tendency to make things worse, not better. Broseph. As for Elminster, he saved the realms more times than legend can recount. But to take on a god is no easy feat, even for him. My orb is the best chance we have. And only I can wield it. <sighs> so that's it. Okay, there's surely another way. If there was, I'm sure the goddess of magic and the greatest wizard who ever lived would have identified it. But alas... Only one solution is offered. That remains ahead of us for now. The heart of the Absolute must be discovered before I can stop its beating. <sighs> okay. You're not blowing yourself up, Gail. I won't let you. She's gonna say that. Let's save such certainty for the moment such a decision is upon us. You may feel differently once we know what we're truly <gasps> up against. Fine. I'm still not letting you do it. It's not gonna happen, Gail. Sorry. Okay, let's talk to everybody else. Hi, do you hate me? Still? I can't believe Mistress demanding Gail sacrifice himself to destroy the Absolute. The it's just a good waste for you. of a perfectly good cult that we could be controlling. <laughs> and a waste of a perfectly good Gail, I suppose. Aw, look at you. Oh, look at him. He's slowly starting to open up to being friends with people and care about people. Slowly, a little bit. I think he still hates me, but... Um, look at him looking out for Gale. I thought he was about to just, like, be the only reasoning was, like, we could have a perfectly good cult to control. And then he came in with the the Gale part, too. That was cute. I liked that. Okay, shout heart. I can't believe Mistra actually expects Gale to just sacrifice himself like that. Seems like a waste of a fine mind. Aww. Aww, everybody's worried about Gail. And they're all trying to play it off like, it's just like a waste. But I think they all care about him, that's cute. Uh, okay. I know that I sh like, I haven't gone through these conversations with her like at all. Um, actually, sh let's just do it right now, sorry. I am really giddy to move on in the, in the, <laughs> I just reminded myself how giddy I am to move on. <laughs> sorry, sorry Shadowheart. Okay. <laughs> Was that Gail's granddad? <laughs> Cute. 
That was Elminster Amar, Amar, the most famous wizard in the realms. <sighs> yeah, it doesn't ring a bell. <laughs> but all right. Must have had something important to say to Gail if he came all this way. Oh, she didn't Good hear it. Good news, I hope. Oh, she didn't hear it. I don't think it was. It turns out Gail has an explosive bomb in his chest, and Minstra had asked, has asked him to use it to blow up the heart of the Absolute. <laughs> Whoa, now. You just gotta... <laughs> well... I guess that would explain a little, but... Mistra? <laughs> I mean, this is a lot to take in. Yeah, I thought you were up to date. What's Sorry. What's he going to do? Um, I think he's going to follow through with it. I don't think he'd do that to himself, even if Minstra... He would. I'm not sure. I think he's of several minds. Um, I think he's going to follow through. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I don't know. Well, tell him to pick the right one. <laughs> well, better yet, I'll do it. <sighs> Fucking wizards, man. <laughs> they always need help picking the simple, obvious option. Which is what? If Mistra can't think of another way to stop the Absolute than sacrificing Gale, she's no god worth worshipping. I'll say that to Gale in... Do it. You know, gentle terms. Do it. Tell him that. Oh, I love you. That was fantastic. I was really... I was really thinking she might have said, like... If that's the only way, fucking do it, bro. Um... I love that. Look at everybody coming together and like defending each other. This is so wholesome and heartwarming. I love it so much. Go tell him that. Maybe like, actually I wonder if I brought her with now instead of Lazelle, she could like say that to Gail as we're walking or something. Maybe, I don't know, we'll see. A shame my first brush with the famed Elminster couldn't be a tad more optimistic. Right though? Listen. I might invoke the triad from time to time, appeal to Helm, but I'm no man of faith, not like Gail. I don't know what drives a man to consider his own death among countless others to be an appropriate exchange for yeah. his goddess's forgiveness. Yeah. To me, it all sounds like <laughs> nonsense. The faith that matters most is that which you hold in yourself, in the ones that most matter to you. There you go. Big bomb be damned. Gale's got everything he needs to defeat the Absolute already. Talent, nerve, and powerful allies at his side. This is so I wholesome, I can't. See that. I can't even handle this. This is so wholesome. Gale, I wish you heard all these people and what they have to say about you. Do you have anything nice to say? <laughs> Elminster. Even the Githyanki have heard tell of the Sage of Shadowdale. Some of his works have been translated to Tissu. That doesn't mean his every word carries wisdom, however. Near as I can tell, Mistra demands Gale's faith, but holds no faith in him. <gasps> Why else would she demand Gale sacrifice himself and perhaps so many others? Does she not think he can destroy the Absolute with his own immense talents? What? Does she not know the mighty company that he keeps? Demanding Vlakith may be. This is gonna make me cry. For the good of the Githyanki people. Mistra is concerned only for herself. She just but complimented the heck out of Gale. She'd find forgiveness in a fiery death. <laughs> but I can't help but wonder why he'd want it at all. Aww. You guys. Uh, this is so sweet. Look at her. She just like, she fully had like, I don't know why. I feel like. Like, it was just, like, such a shock for me to, like, Lazelle was the biggest shock that she fully sees Gail's power. Ugh. She, like, fully see like, sees and respects Gail, like, and his abilities. Like, that's so cool. <laughs> um, okay. We're gonna, we're gonna talk to everyone. Uh, I'm not gonna do any of their own, like, dialogue things. Uh, except for, we're gonna see what is up with Halston, because now he is a member of our camp. We'll see if he has anything new. Oh, my good fellow. Probably not. Quite the cozy setup you have here. I'll just make myself comfortable. Okay. Thank you so much. You say that every time. Um, has your research turned up anything? No, because all he's gonna do is look in my eyeball. So, like, why is he here for the rest of the game? The shadow curse is upon us. As foul as I remember it. Perhaps even worse. Okay. But with the Oak Father's blessing, we may soon see it banished from these lands. Okay. Uh, we're in the midst of the Shadow Curse now. 
Is there any more you can tell me about how to lift it? Um, it can't have been easy surrendering your title. Okay, we'll do the shadow curse thing. Hmm. Okay, shadow curse. This land is more than just soil and rock, root and leaf. It is a living being. <sighs> In the form of a young fae boy. What? With the forest itself in his eyes. His name is Thaniel. What? I've met him in my meditations. But what, since I'm, the what? curse was unleashed, I have not felt his presence. He is its prisoner, I fear. And as long as he remains so, his domain will lie in darkness. So we have to save this but spirit thing? If we can find him. Ooh. We can break the curse. If you learn anything of the shadow fell, or of a boy with the forest in his eyes, find me at once. Okay. What should I look for exactly? Also, I said ooh, not who. Daniel. I'm guessing this is not like a living person. They're like cursed. I feel like it's a cursed, like spirit or something. <clears throat> I don't know. I could be wrong. Okay. What should I look for? I can't be exact, unfortunately. Time and the Shadow Curse won't have been kind to any traces that would have been left behind. A living witness is unlikely, I'll admit. But perhaps there'll be an unliving witness, or some lingering echo of what we seek. Okay. Don't worry. If you find something, you will know it. Okay. Okay. Still feeling at home here with us? The surroundings are less... Whatever that word is. It's not easy seeing the ravages of the Shadow Curse. But your camp is a most welcome solace. You've shared your fire with me. Your company. A small pocket of light against the darkness. Yay. But one I couldn't do without. Thank you. Yes. You are welcome. Um, perhaps I could share more than a campfire and some company. Wait, what? Uh, don't get too sentimental. I need a guide. I'm, I had need of a guide. Okay, whatever. Uh, I'm glad, but let's keep focused at the same time. You're welcome. <laughs> You're too modest by far. What fate would I have met without you? Rotting in the goblin cells? Dying against an onslaught on the grove? More good has been done since I met you than in a hundred years before. Okay. Words cannot express my gratitude. Okay, you're welcome. <laughs> um, maybe you could show your appreciation another way. Oh, boy. Okay. Uh, no words needed. I understand how you feel. <laughs> yes. I think you do. Oh, okay. Yep. Forgive me. Sometimes <laughs> I forget myself, gazing on the beauty of nature's creations. Ah! Ah! <laughs> okay. Uh, bye. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't realize that that's where you were getting at there. I didn't realize. I Do you guys see how oblivious I am, like IRL? I'm just like thinking we're having a normal conversation. He's like, no, you don't understand. I'm very thankful for you and your beauty. <laughs> I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> that is hilarious. Okay, anyways, let's go find what's his face. Why can I never remember his name? Barkus. Um, and I'll pet you in a minute. Okay, I'll pet you now. I pet you now because I love you. Tail wags pet you now. Halston has major flirt 100% of the time. Or is a major flirt. Scratch his tongue Throw a bucket of water at Halston. Catholic. That was so funny. His tail wagging even <laughs> faster. <laughs> ah! Um, okay. Hi, Withers. Barkus is all the way the heck over here having a moment of solace. Or just drinking something. What are you doing? Thank you for agreeing to find Walbrin. It means a great deal to me. Yes. Do you Indeed. have anything else to say? Or no? Okay, you don't. Okay, so we're good. We're golden. Um, Let's leave then and continue on our way. I'm actually... You guys, I think I'm going to bring Karlak instead of Lizelle. Because we finished the crash. We'll bring her back out again. But I, I, we've never had Gale and Karlak together. So I kind of want to just like switch up things as much as possible. Um, greetings. Greetings. <clears throat> Wait for me in camp. Sorry. Bye. Are you sure that's <laughs> the best course of action? Just for right now. Uh, stay in camp. I'll fetch you when the time is right. Confirmed. Confirmed. Until then, I remain at the ready. Sounds good. Thank you. All right, Carlac, let's go. Let's go. 
What are you thinking about? Um, I'm thinking that I want you to come with me. Come on, we're heading out. Let's go, go, go. Yay. Okay. So, oh, damn it. I always forget about that I when can't. I switch people out. I have to freaking do this. Come but there, on, she's easy, go. though, because we don't have to worry about spells. So, too bad you can't have a party of five. Right, though? No. Additional rage charge. Gained a passive. Health increased. Sticking with the bear heart. I, I still, I read through all these and I still really like the bear. I do. Okay, we're sticking with that. Ooh, okay. Ooh. What do I want? Animal aspect. Uh, the aspect of the bear infuses you, you with strength. Your carrying capacity is doubled and you have advantage on strength checks. Grants you a nimble mischievousness. You gain resistance to falling damage and throwing camp supplies. Blinds targets? <laughs> what? Agility in the water. Your movement speed increases by three meters while standing in water-based surfaces. Enhances your eyesight. You can see in the dark up to 12 meters. Um, giving yourself and nearby allies extra movement speed. At all times? Or do I like... Oh, it's a passive feature. Honey badger doesn't give a fuck. If you're poisoned, frightened, or charmed at the start of your turn, you have a 50% chance to begin raging without expending a rage charge. Oh, that's kind of cool, actually, though. Stallion. Dashing grants you temporary hit points equal to twice your barbarian level. Can only have temporary hit points from one source. These are all good. Add additional strength modifier to attack rolls against bleeding or poison targets. And gain proficiency in survival. That sounds good too. Gain proficiency in stealth and can use aspect of the wolf. Thank you. What is aspect of the wolf? Um, you and nearby allies add your dexterity modifier as a bonus to stealth checks. Wolverine. When you attack bleeding or poison target, you also... What does that even mean? You what it? Movement speed reduced to zero. Oh, oh my god, I don't know what I want. Honey badger. Uh, elk. Extra movement speed for everyone. Sure. Okay, cool. Wolverine would have been cool with adamantine claws. Yeah, that would have been cool. Um, okay, we're ready to go, guys. Let's go. Okay. Oh, oh, I was going to try to bust open that thing. That's fine. I'll buy a lot of more um, lock picks and things. And it's going to suck if we have to get through a bunch of doors and shit. Ooh, I have a key, though. I have a key. What is this? Oh. Contains a series of architectural, pl architectural plans. An elevator leading from the wilds outside a town called... Rythwin to the Underdark. Cool. Is that what we just took up here? Maybe. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to move forward. Look at you guys. Look at it. New team. New team. New team. Love it. Woohoo. Okay. Um, actually, we have had Gale and Carlac together. I, I remember that. We had them briefly together in the Underdark, but it didn't last long. Um, okay, anyways. Okay, so we have another lantern. Another moon lantern. I don't know how to use it. Um, we got one front in the Underdark in the Grim Forge area. Um, and I feel like that would help us. Ooh. I feel like that would help us get through the Shadow Curse or whatever. But, like, I don't... haven't been told how to use it, like, in the game yet. Don't tell me. Uh, okay. I've been given the crucial task to clear the entrance to Grim Forge for future expeditions. True soul near, who is dead, because I killed him, will follow once the entrance is cleared. As I make my way to the entrance, I can't help but feel excitement. Uh, what might we find here that Catheric created so long ago, now sealed by the curse? Grimforge could hold untold treasures for the absolute's uses. I will continue to explore and document my findings. The entrance is currently blocked by vines and rubble, quite cursed. Explosives ought to do the job, though. Ought to do the job. Though I'm not as experienced in such matters as I'd wish to be. Um, I'd set, I set up explosives with care, though I admit I'm almost afraid to detonate them. There's no telling what power these cursed vines hold, what might lie beyond, or whether I've even set things up correctly. Absolute protect me. Um, apparently it didn't work out very well. Sorry, dude. Uh, unless you got killed by some... It looks like you, maybe you got killed by the vines after exploding them. That could be. Sorry, sniffles. So bad. Sorry, you guys. My allergies are have been really bad lately maybe it's like the switching in from winter to spring i don't know or maybe it's just i'm allergic to my cats and i'm constantly in an allergy state oh, okay sorry <gasps> okay 
Moving on. Oh my god, I'm so excited, you guys. I can't even. To the Shadow Curse lamp. But I need, I need to use my lantern. Oh my gosh. Okay, what if I like... What, okay, let me look at it. I feel like I need... I have two of these now. The glass is cracked. It's metal bent beyond repair. This... Can I equip it as a light source? No, I can't. Can I equip it? I cannot. Okay, so... I can't like really use it or have it on me. All right, well, hopefully there will be <laughs> uh, some type of dialogue where I can light it. <gasps> oh, I'm so excited, you guys. Oh, I'm so giddy. Squad, look at us, we're so cool. Those shadows, there's power coursing through them. Oddly familiar. Better stay on alert. Oh! I've never Should seen I? darkness like this before. It's unsettling. Look at her mouth moves when she darkness talks. Darkness or not, we need to reach Moonrise Towers. Oh! What if I light these? Braziers. <laughs> uh, oh, that's a torch. No, I didn't want that. I have way too many torches. Okay. I'm lighting up the way so we can find our way back. Maybe, if we need to. <sighs> Ready? Ready, friends? I mean, I have the, those, like, magical lanterns, but I don't know how to use them. Don't tell me. I feel like there has to be some point in which I find something that I can light it with. You know? Um, okay. Oh, okay. I'm gonna keep that in mind. Like, there's things that I have in my brain that I could possibly try but I'm just gonna see what we're gonna face first. Oh, I'm so nervy. This is so cool. I'm like tiptoeing my way into here because I want to see everything. This is so cool. Maybe I should back up my view so I can like see everything. I'm guessing this is gonna hurt me walking through it. Oh, we're fine. Oh, we're fine. Just kidding, okay. Wrong. I feel weak, drained. Yeah, we're not fine. Shadow Curse is a powerful threat Shadows that lurks and devours in the see. darkness. Surround yourself with I light to avoid the most Lady lethal Shell. effects. Oh. Oh shit. All right, everybody, get out of there first of all. Um, so that was not a good idea. I should, I should have saved. I should save. I should save right now. How do? Okay, surround myself. Don't I have? Don't I have a light type of spell? Maybe? I think Shadowheart does, but I don't think it follows us. Um, okay. Hold on. Do you... Okay, do you have it? Dancing lights. Okay, now she's better. So if we just stay here and around it and then oh, keep the magic touch. like step by step being by the light. I don't think she's like Huh. I don't know. Can we move the light? Does it move with us? It requires concentration. Huh. But I just want to walk. I don't want to, like, go through like this. I want to be lit up. Can you light up someone with it? Can I... Dancing lights. No. Um... I want to walk without doing this. Like, how long are we going to have to... Oh! 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 What is this? How do I use this? Did... Was that just on me? <gasps> oh, it's my weapon! Okay, hold on. Hold on. It's my weapon. It is on the weapon, but if everyone stays next to me, these are rhetorical questions, yes. I'm just thinking out loud. Um, if everyone stays next to Shadowheart, they should be fine. I would think, is that not enough light? I tried equipping, oh. I tried equipping this lantern, but I can't. Unless, hold on, 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 hold on. 
Hold on. I have an idea. This is an idea that I was going to try. Okay? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. This is an idea that I was going to try. Uh. My faith will guide me. Oh, she is em emitting light. No! <laughs> no! I was trying to put the dancing lights in there. <laughs> um, I do have a torch, but I thought it had to be a special light, I guess. So I think that Shadowheart is fine with her weapon. Um, and then Zendra might just have to... Oh, yeah, Zendra might just have to have a torch. Um, her flame blade doesn't last that long. Use it. Use it. Equip. Okay. Do you have a torch? Uh, we should all be fine if you guys stay close to me. And then Shadowheart has that. I thought it had to be... It would be cooler if it had to be like a special light with that special lantern. You know? Can I have that? Ooh. Okay, let me look at the journal. Okay, excuse me. Seek protection from the Shadow Curse. A deadly shadow curse plagues the land. Nier had a moon lantern to protect himself from it. We may need to find something similar if we want. Oh, it's just to find something similar. I thought we had to use that. Clear that the parasites are coming from moonrise towers, infiltrating the towers and finding the source of the evil may be our only chance at finding a cure. Dialogue being very misleading here. Also, I was like, you need magic light and the torch works just fine. That's so silly. That's where, that's where my brain was. I was like, no, we need to do something really special with this moon, moon lantern because it has to be a special light. Because he made it seem like it, was, it had to be special, but I didn't realize you could just use a fucking torch. <laughs> so yeah, that's why I didn't like. I knew we had a. T I knew I had a torch. Like I'm not like dumb <laughs> in that way. Uh, but like I thought, it was telling me that I had to have like a special light in the moon lantern. Like I thought, like they made a big deal about it. You know, like they, they made a whole cutscene about this moon lantern. So I was like, oh, I have to have special moonlight in it to like go through the shadow curse. So I was like, there's no way that just like a torch would work. It has to be magic light. <laughs> so, okay, that makes sense. All right, I mean, it doesn't make sense, but whatever. But whatever. Um, okay, open please, yay. Infuse an object with an aura of light. Oh, um, Gail, can I infuse your staff? Can I infuse you? Are you light now? <laughs> Wait. Seek and you shall find Do you have a light feature on you now? Did that work? Oh, his staff is. Okay. His staff has light. Okay. And then Zendra is just gonna also have a torch. Why is it put it in there? I don't know. I, I use the toggleables, but it doesn't toggle um, my whatever. All right. So Gale and Shadowheart have magical light weapons. Can you guys succeed this, please? Oh my god. For dumb. Black Oleander. I'll take that. What did you, what was here? Okay, cool. What was here? I want to know. Okay. Anywho. Druid's journal. Dead Druid's journal. Okay. Handwritten journal abandoned for some 50 years. It details Druid's attempt to learn more about the Shadow Curse. Okay. The entries grow, grow shorter and more sporadic at time, as time passes. Make good progress through the mountains. Seeing the curse for the first time filled me with an awe and fear that was difficult to describe. No writing could have prepared me, nor any artist's rendition. As grave as the Arc Druid. Okay, whatever. I don't know if I want to... The wood will not burn. I can barely see the page. I'm surrounded. Creatures from the darkness, foul things. One grazed me. Only my torch saved me. Deep darkness flames are instantly doused. <gasps> the wound stings. Flesh is turning black with corruption. Oh my god, it's crazy. That's wild. Okay. Anyway. to do with the shadow curse? What? I truly hope this blight isn't spreading. Oh, I'm inspired by that druid journal. That's cool. Is this quarterstaff like neat at all? Not really. Nah, okay. Um, continuing. Did that do like a journal thing at all or no? Okay. All right, so we have light. Um, we should all be good. 
Carl I think Carlac will be in close proximity to any of us at any moment. I think Gil's staff is still lit up. We should be good. We should be fine. I think. We're gonna save though. Um, okay, so that makes sense as to why is that like they went through that little wall of the shadow curse I think that's the shadow curse where it's all green and glowy um, And only Zendra got hurt because the other two were right next to Shadowheart who has the glowing light of Lathander People Hello, are you enemies? Hi Stay together. Keep to the light. Hi do you want to travel together? Uh-oh. Oh, just kidding. We're sneaking up on them, apparently. Stop! Who's there? Why are you being sneaky? <laughs> my name is Zendra. Who are you? I'm a sorcerer, so kindly lower your weapons, or who knows what my magic might... What my magic might do? Um, sorry, I'm trying to talk too fast. Back away from them, palms up. A nightmare in the dark. Uh, she's gonna be like, My name is Zendra. Who are you? <laughs> First, come closer. <laughs> Hands up. That's fine. Oh, that was weird. Okay. Hi. We're all okay here. We're all friends. It's okay. Hi. Jonas, move in. What do you mean? Are you gonna try to capture me? What are you looking at? Oh! No! No! Jonas! Jonas! I'm here! Where are you? Jonas? Can you see our torches? That's not you, that's not him. I can't see anything! That's not him. Wrong. That's not him. Follow my voice. Come back to the light. Who's there? Meg? Is that? Ah! I felt him die in my controller. Oh, that's terrifying. Oh, this turned into a horror movie. That's not him. That's not him. Oh God! <gasps> Shut up! Jonas. That's terrifying. Uh, Gary to fight. Papas, two arms. Oh my God! All right. Good thing I have a fucking torch equipped. Uh, shoot me! Oh shit! That was. Crazy! That was terrifying. They did such a good job making this like actually so scary. Shit. Oh, you guys don't die. I want to talk to you. Oh my god, we haven't even gotten a chance to go yet. Oh god, oh god. We're gonna have to kill him, I'm so sorry. I mean, they're attacking him too, okay. Um, okay, okay. Um, holy smokes. All right, so there isn't one up here, is there? He didn't, hold on. Yeah, there isn't. I don't think. I just wanna see where they all are. Okay. All right, Gail, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Is this the action, that's a bonus action. Plus a level two spell slot though. What is this? Oh, his orb! <gasps> Are you serious? I can just trigger this at any moment. I have the power to do that. Are you serious? That's so scary. What if I accidentally click it? We're just gonna save and uh, if I accidentally fucking click that. <laughs> That's crazy! Okay. Uh, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? Gail, Gail, Gail. Let's just, let's just start out with some magic missiles. How about? Let's just do that. And you'll stay back here. We're just gonna we're gonna go ahead and start off strong. Um, get all these dudes. Okay, who? Well, I think there's only th oh, there's four visible. All right, then we'll get you again. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. Um, and then maybe... No, I was gonna have a Misty step over here, but I'll just have him sit behind Carlock. That'll be good. <laughs> That'll be good. Ow. Okay, I need her to switch out her weapon really, really quickly. Excuse me. The fuck? Alright. Um, Shadowheart, you are going to actually... I kind of want her to heal this person. Uh, we're gonna try to keep everyone alive. I don't know. Um... We'll just do a level one on you. Take two. Okay. And then guiding bolt. I'm guessing like the divine or the, what is it? The radiant damage is going to be really good on these guys. The shadow guys, you know, hopefully. Yes, it is. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah, shadow heart. Okay. You need to, you need to. Um, we need to <laughs> re-equip this. Uh, I don't know how to, like, I know how to toggle the, between ranged melee, but it only, on the PlayStation 5, I feel like it only toggles between ranged and melee and doesn't toggle the light source, which is weird. Um, but anyways, I hope that wasn't an action. It could have been. <laughs> Motherfucker. Um, that's fine. She is going to probably just misty step. What is that? An additional level one spell slot. It's not really dire. Um, fall into a two turn slumber. Oh, you get the benefits of a long rest. That's actually pretty cool. I'm um, draw poison. What is this? Level two. All right, I'm just gonna have you. Let's see step. Or, or. I'm gonna equip this right now because that is a light source and that should do good against them. Where'd they go? Did they go back underground into the shadows? She's just this gonna, way. I might fight people with this. Or if someone comes up to me, I can hit them with this, I guess. Okay. Um, okay, Carlac, where are you going? Where did the shadow dudes go? Oh, we still need to fight that guy, that sucks. Oh, they're like underground. That's dumb. All right, she's gonna go maybe fight this or make her way slowly towards um, the guy who got turned because he's probably stronger than the other guys. Um, and then she's going to... Can I rush attack without having... Oh, I can. Oh, I can, okay. I thought I needed more movement to do that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, weapon attack. Ooh. This is a bonus action. Uh, we'll just do this. Down. Perfect. We're trying. Oh. Okay, there they appeared again. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Oh, she's just attacking with the torch. I mean, that's not a bad idea, to be honest. Because they don't like it. The light. Alright, um, Gale. Okay, you can... You can... Wait, I don't know if Firebolt... I don't know if she'll be resistant to Firebolt. Or Fireball. So I'm gonna not do that right now. Cause I, just because I don't know. Um, we're just gonna stick with this. A level two, how about get these three and you again? There you go, there you go. Ow! Oh no! Oh, did she die? Die, or is she just down? Ow. Um, okay, guiding bolt because that works really well. Um, is this like I wish I knew if like. They did radiant damage. No, they all do the same type of damage. That's so weird. Okay, whatever. Um, you can come out here and fight these guys. Um, they do like force damage or whatever. But okay. We're gonna do another level three. Ow. Yes. Oh my gosh. Shadowheart's like the most powerful in this scenario right now. It's awesome. Survival is all that matters. Okay, and then you, I'm just gonna hit you with 
with my flame blade. Flame blade, flame blade. And that's it, I guess. <laughs> actually, she's pretty hurt, so I'm gonna actually have you go out here and then uh, over here. Encumbered? When did I get encumbered? Oh, hi. <laughs> I'm gonna get hurt. Um, okay, you go fight this guy. You're gonna go fight this guy. And you're going to... Should she rage? I guess I, do. I forgot that she can rage. Rawr! Actually, lighting up this might be a good idea, but that's gonna cost an action, I bet. Um, okay. I'm gonna come help you, dude. We're trying to keep everyone alive. Okay, and then... Do this. Bye. Sorry. Sorry, bye. And then she's gonna come back over here to help Sandra. Oh, who's almost dying. Okay. All right, yeah, help me. <laughs> Are you serious? Apparently, oh, okay. I was like, apparently there's someone back here because it keeps going back here. So the camera keeps doing that. All right, okay, Shadowheart actually needs to do some healing really bad. <sighs> okay, um, Gale. But you ca we can't freaking see this guy, so dumb. Okay, actually all of Gale's power is gonna go to this guy because you're not gonna hurt Zendra. Ugh, ow. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. And Missy Step over, all the way the fuck over here, behind Karlak. <laughs> Eee, okay. Um, all right. Cool. Don't hurt me. Ah! Ha. Ha. And you should be able to reach him. You don't move very far, do you? Okay. Um, shadow, you just come a little closer. We need a lot of healing. Um, uh, sanctuary. Don't we have? Yes. Mass healing word. Yes. I'm just going to direct it onto her just in case it doesn't do that. Okay. Perfect. Great. Fantastic. Here, wounds. Can I reach you? I can't. Um, I mean, this will take you out, but there's still another guy. Uh, this will take... I need to find the other guy. He's invisible. He's invisible. That's what I should have done that with Carlax. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You have this. Oh, I can't use it anymore. Fuck. Okay, we just don't know where he is. That sucks. Who has the invisibility? Never a dull moment. I don't think anyone does. Unless there's like a... Unless I have a... Scroll. For it. Oop. The invisibility. What? Enchant the weapon of each creature. Huh? Enchant weapons? I can enchant weapons? How? Where did... That didn't work. Because I still can't see him. Unless he has to be within range. Time to press ahead. I still can't see him! Dumb. Right? I can't. I can't see him. That's stupid. How do I enchant weapons? I can enchant weapons of anybody. But I don't know how. Can I enchant your weapon? No. Maybe next turn? Okay, whatever. Uh, going back to Shadowheart. And you are just going to get rid of this guy. Guiding Bolt. We'll just do one. On you. You're out of here. Okay. Okay. Important and crazy. you're done. And we don't know where he is. I think he's this way, though. Um, okay. Oh, why did my rage go away? Can you see him? There you are. Ooh. Oh, shit. Oh, so many of them freaking died. 
Sorry, guys. We tried to help, and uh, we didn't do much. Of course. <laughs> we didn't do much there. I apologize. Oh, boy. Okay. I'm going to use fire on him, actually. Okay. Uh, you can't reach him anyways. He's just running around trying to catch up to everyone. Uh, okay. Guiding lights. You're out of here. Out. Done. Nice oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, you guys. Some chops. More will be here soon. We need to go. There's a place nearby. Okay. All right, lead the way. Keep close. Avoid the shadows. Okay. Okay, wait though. I want to loot things. Oh my god, you guys, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What a bunch of horseradish. Am I encumbered still? Why am I not encumbered anymore now? All of a sudden. Received reports of increased cult activity near last light. There are larger groups than ever moving through the area. If they're gathering strength, we need to know. Take your unit and patrol the hills to the east. Uh, observe and report back only. Do not engage unless you have no other choice. She died. I'm so sorry. Uh, they have a lot of good things. Though. Hand axe. Eh. Cloak. Ooh. All right. Um, anything else? Shadow vestige. Scrubbing the floor of an inn. Aww. The patrons made a mess of things again the night before. Aww. It's so these shadow these shadows were once people. Dang. That sucks. Okay, let's light. Why don't you guys have these lit? To keep the space lit. So many letters. Oh my gosh. Okay, I am. God's damned genius. <laughs> this curse has people legging it. A couple of idiots begged me to run back and grab their stuff, but the ring, the ring is my ticket to the city. <gasps> the old man was desperate. You should have heard the sob story. Ellie Mae was his wife. Love his, love of his life, blah, blah. <laughs> he used to camp by her grave. Kind of weird, if you ask me. Aw. Um, anyway, she was buried with the family ring. Ooh, it's deeper into the darkness. I'll grab it and be on my way. So he didn't make it. Baldur's Gate better prepare itself, because with the two of us in the city, we'll wring every last copper out of the place. Cute. Um, so we might have a mission there, maybe. Okay. Um, hopefully I didn't lose track of those guys. Hopefully I'll be on my map. Lift the Shadow Curse. According to Halston, if we want to lift the Shadow Curse, we must find Ban, y'all. Okay. Um, yeah, there, this, what? Where did you guys go? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Infiltrate Moonrise Towers. No! Where'd you guys go? Oh, no. Oh, no. Did we lose them? I'm guessing we'll find them. Like, eventually. What is happening here? What is it? Never had a chance. The curse consumes oh, everything it's consumed it by the curse. Oh, that's sad. Um, okay. I think we lost them. Uh, I'm sure we'll find them, though. Aww. He sense a young woman. Gazing at Moonrise Towers in awe. Mm. Perhaps one day she will get to gaze at the so top sad. Of it, she hopes. I would like the night orchid, please. And then maybe some more of this stuff. Um, that's so sad. All of these shadows were once people and we could see their like fondest memories. I'm not gonna do look at all of them because I'll cry. Oop, no! Frickin' stop! <laughs> Just trying to light it. I've collected a bunch of torches, though. <laughs> okay. Sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay, he went this way, though, so... Okay, so I think we should just, like, not just, like, walk into the little, like, glowy bits and we'll be fine. You know? Who's here? Who sees me? Someone see me up here? I should save. <gasps> Great. Great. Fantastic. Okay. I should have said we need a minute because then he probably would have put on the map where I'm going. Ah! Oh no! <laughs> you are surprised. I am also surprised. Oh jeez. Oh jeepers. Oh boy. What if we die? Good thing I saved. We might die here. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god! 
Oh no! Oh no! Did all of her turns get skipped? Holy smokes! Oh my god! <laughs> Excuse me? Um, what the hell? Okay, what if this works good with them? I don't know. No, we're gonna die. Oh no, we're gonna die. We're gonna die. Can we retreat maybe a little bit? Oh no. Oh no. Can I, do I have another bonus action right now that I could take a potion with? I don't think so. Oh God. Oh god. Oh, we might have to reload this day. We might die here. What are you doing? Why are you going out there? What's happening there? Okay. Okay. Um, Gail, I need you to do this right now. Uh I need you to do this right now. Ugh. Yeah, um, okay. So we took out a, a, a lot of them. Dead. Okay, we're fine. We'll be fine. Good job, Gail. Good job, Gail. All right, uh, you're gonna come right here. And you're gonna rage. And we're gonna get out of this. Do I have a sweeping one? Shit. I was thinking of Lizelle. Um, What is this? Oh. Uh. Oh boy. Searing smite. You. Ugh. Ow. Ah! Ah! No, we were so good. We were there. We were. Ugh. I. We. I, I, I was there. We could have had it. They do blow up too. And I didn't think that he was going to blow up and kill Carlac. These guys are really difficult. That's crazy. Okay. We're not going to. We're not going to do that right now. But I mean, like, when am I gonna come back here, though? We should take a short rest first. Act two is built different. Just a brief respite. Yes, okay. Okay, we're fine. Okay, we're gonna go into it like this. We're gonna do this, though. We're gonna do this. Because Gail can blow them all up. Ah! Except we all get fucking rocked. First round. Oh, okay. Um, no, let us. Why do we? Oh, because we're surprised. That's why. Okay, I get it. Oh, God. Okay. <sighs> no, I want to do this. So I don't feel like I'm going to come back here. All right, everyone just attack Zendra. Great, fine. Strict on Carlac. Save. Okay. Okay, who are we? Who am I? I am Gail. No, I'm Carlock. Okay, um... Carlock's gonna go over here and fight these guys. And she's going to rage. And then... And then... And then... And then... Okay, we're just gonna do this. We're just gonna do this. And then we'll just get them both down. That was weird. Okay. Um, all right. Gail, you are going to firebolt, fireball, and get these three. Carlac. Oh, God. Oh, God. Sorry, Carlac. Oh, she's fine. Okay. Um, good job, Gail. Look at you. Uh, are you still alive, though? Fuck. Okay, you're just gonna kind of go over here. Oh, shit. There's a guy there. Ugh. Ugh, I don't know where to go. Go up here. Oh, wait, can you help her? Not enough resources. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay. Um, healing. Lots of healing. 
Lots of healing. Um. Ah. Uh, Guiding bolt. I could halt someone. Maybe. Ooh. I should heal her more. I'm gonna go up to her. You are not allowed to die. Take two. Okay. Okay. No choice but to keep going. All right, Zendra, you can't do anything. Fuck. You can go get out of here a little bit though. And like, I don't know, fight this guy. Okay. Oh, heal all creatures. When you hit a target with a spell, heal all creatures. <gasps> cool. Okay, cool. Wild magic. Okay. I, it's not even toggled on. I'm confused. Oh, that's Tides of Chaos. My wild magic is on, though. Okay, anyways. I thought that was the same thing for some reason. I thought the Tides of Chaos was my wild magic. Ah! Okay, um... Immobile. These two are dead. Uh, you can uh, take a potion, and then, oops, and then ranged attack. Ugh, shit. Ranged attack again, I guess. Wait, can I? Do I? Ha oh. Let's do that again. Don't miss. Gale, um, shit. We're gonna do more of this, I guess. And then these guys. Ugh. Ah. Okay. Good, fine, fine. We're good. We're we're good. We're fine. Oh god. Gale's down. Fuck. No, he's fine. Oh, he's fine. Um. Okay. Healing. Oh shit! What is this? Brilliant light blinds all creatures in its path, including my friends. Sunbeam to you. Can I sunbeam you? I didn't click. No, I clicked this guy. What do you mean? Why did that hit Gale? Oh my god. I clicked that guy, I swear. Did you guys see that? You saw that. You saw that I clicked this guy. He was like red, right? That was crazy. What do you mean? Okay, there's this thing. Oh god, okay. Um uh, uh, did I not? Did I not do that? What do you mean? Oh, I healed him. Did I heal him because I cast a spell? Stupid. Okay, whatever. <laughs> I should have took greater healing, whatever. Oh, this is dumb. Okay. Yeah. Oh, she's fine though. Ugh. All right, am I, am I still constricted? Mother flip. Um, hold on. Do, do, can I give this to Carlac, please? Actually, what is this as well? Break your, Target's concentration and silence it. Uh, yeah, it still does damage. Does that is that the concentration? Is the ensnaring thing? Though that might be nice. Hold on, I'm just gonna. Oh, oh my god. I'm just going. To, I'm gonna. Oh, ugh, ugh, it still does damage. Only three to twelve. I think he's concentrated. Yeah. Are you? Flippin' serious. Okay, will you die, please? Please? That'd be fantastic. Okay, help him. Oh, shit. Uh. Uh. 
Can I disengage as an action? But this is an action too. Shit. I need to give him a healing potion. I can throw one at him. Mm. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Um. Give me split like four. Give those to. Where'd they go? Where'd the split go? Oh, I see it. Sorry, guys. Uh, to Shadowheart. Okay. Shadowheart. Throw. This. A potion. At Gale. Ugh, there you go. Okay. Perfect. Love it. Okay. And I can main attack you. Main hand attack you. Okay, cool. Can't even catch my breath. Um, yeah. So, we're struggling a little bit. It's fine. What is this? Oh, what is this? Infuse a creature with psionic force. If it reaches zero hit points, it heals instead of falling unconscious. Huh. Um, ooh, I got all this shit. Fireball! <laughs> Fireball, you! You're gonna die. Oh, <laughs> okay, I, I got saved from the needle burst. That's good. Yay. I just wanted to take him out, okay? Alright. Oh, okay. We're doing this. We're doing this. We're fine. We're good. We've got it. Just die. Thank you. Holy shit. Oh, well, all right. Well, I can't move still. Oh, no, I can. Um, can I... Can I rush attack you? Watch this. Huh. Oh, really? Rush attack. E. Cool. And pommel. Pommel. Boop. Yes. Almost down. All right. So he can't do anything. Uh. What is this? Fire resistance. Can you leave? You can. Yay. On my way. Ugh. Oh, there's this guy too, I forgot. Okay, you can hit him with this. Awesome. Nothing will stand in my You way. can uh, hit him with, okay, and you. Yes! Ugh. Oh, thank God. All right, everybody, quick rest really fast. It's time to get going. So no one dies. Oh, thank God we did it. <laughs> that was tough. That was super tough. That was crazy. Holy smokes. That was wild. Nice job. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> I need Coming to back later up. is totally valid. I just feel like I wouldn't do that. Like, I just would forget to come back here. Um, But I don't know. Maybe I should. Oh, my God. You guys are idiots. Uh, Okay. Can I? Can I? Pick up. Okay, now I'm encumbered. Yes, I'm gonna send this. To I'm just sending all the chests back because I don't have any lockpicks. Uh, where'd it go? This. Wooden chest. Sent to camp. Alright. Which we're going there anyways because we desperately need to rest. <laughs> Why? Oh, I'm shadow cursed. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm shadow cursed. No, come back here. Okay, light. You guys are lit up. I need to be by you. Um, okay, we're going to... We're going to long rest after that. That was wild. <laughs> Setting up camp in the freaking Shadow Curse area is wild. Speaking of, what is all that noise? That's scary. <gasps> Playtime's over, pet. Ms. Zora, what are you doing? Oh, I love this time of year. The dickheads start popping up wherever you look. What do you want, Mizora? Drop the attitude and perk up your ears. You've got a new mission. Absolute's cult has gone and grabbed one of Zariel's assets. A devil. What? And a powerful one at that. Who? They're locked up in the cult's fortress. Oh, gee. Moonrise Towers. A 
and you're getting him out. Why? Um, and this is the problem. How exactly? Forget it. This asset can rot in the towers. If this devil is so powerful, how did they manage to get captured? Ooh, I'm gonna say that. If this devil is so powerful, how did they manage to get captured? Well, your playmate's wasting precious time. Let's see about getting her priorities fixed. That was a valid question. <clears throat> Clause Z, section 13. <laughs> Should promised soul refuse obeyance or neglect duty, the pact holder shall cast the promised into a vernus as a lean mule. <sighs> I'll make it simple. Will fails or refuses, and he turns to a thick blob of stink flesh oh, and God. sinks to a vernus. Now. Be a good boy and play fetch, pup. Or you'll spend an eternity sizzling in the hell. Ah, uh, well. words may be flippant, but they are tinged with desperation. Hmm. She cannot afford for Will to fail this oh, mission. Oh, we have this something may on be her. your best chance to negotiate <gasps> out of his pact. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, we'll rescue your asset on one condition. <gasps> oh, and what condition is that? I love that I succeeded that. Links with Wills, drawn in by his increasing panic. What are you doing? I love that we can talk to each other in our minds. Um, responsible in your mind, trust me. You okay? Should okay? I'll respond to him, and then I can still talk to her. Okay, responsible in your mind, trust me. Will relaxes, and your connection fades. Okay, Mizora will rescue this asset if you release Will from his pact. Interesting. Now, why should I go letting my favorite pet off his leash? Uh, we could always let the cult infect the asset. I bet they'd make a loyal thrall. Oh, shit. Okay. Um, remember all you can about devils and their contracts. Um, this is plus three plus one. Okay. Say you know a pact breaking charm and chant a series of pseudo infernal phrases. Okay. This one seems like it'll be the best. But remember all you can about devils in their contracts. Oh god. <sighs> this better work. Oh, okay, we're good. Oh my god, we're good. Whew! Whew! <laughs> oh, right on the money too. You recall an old incantation from a children's story said to void a devil's contract. Abi diabole et nunquam ready. Okay. So that was true. So she can say that now. Um, okay, she can say this and then she'll know what it means. <laughs> That's panic laughter, isn't it? She's slightly panicking. I've never seen such a fearless display of sheer idiocy. Bravo. <laughs> Fine. I'll play your game. <laughs> But I amend the pact once the mission's done, not before. Fine. Clause F, section 9. Soulbinder shall bestow reward or favor only upon soul bearer's fulfillment of related obligation. Okay. Now, to moonrise, pet. And do mind the shadows. They've been especially hungry. Oh, this is so, this is getting so good, you guys. It's just like so much is happening. I love this so much. I'm so excited right now. <laughs> this is so cool. Oh, a lot of people want to talk to us. Okay, hold on. Um, so before we end, we're gonna chat with everyone apparently. Um, okay, okay, okay. A Sarian wants to talk. Uh, all right. Starting with Sarian, I guess. This dark land must be filled with the broken, the beaten. The desperate. The perfect praying ground for a devil who offers a way out for those who sign on the dotted line. I hope we end up seeing our oh, friend yeah. Raphael down here somewhere. Why do you want to see him? Uh, why do you want to see him? That's funny. That's literally what I just asked. I certainly hope we don't. Uh, that friend is far from our... That fiend is far from our friend. Um, he's got a lot of... He's a lot of fun and could be useful if we tread carefully. Uh, why do you want to see him? Help me find him. And you'll find out. Okay. When I was taken to his house, I was caught off guard. Ooh. But now, now I know 
what to ask for. Oh. Do you, don't tell me. My thought is that he might ask Raphael to cure his vampirism or get him out of a contract with who, like his vampire that bit him. That's what I'm kind of thinking. Maybe, I don't know. Um, sure, I want to see how this plays out. Your funeral, but why not? Uh, not unless you tell me what you're planning. Full of bad ideas, though you are. Wait, full of bad ideas, though you are. This is definitely the one of the worst. Okay, sure, I want to see how this plays out. Zendra's like, sure, why not? <laughs> Perfect. I knew you would understand. <laughs> uh, funny. Zendra's like, oh, I'll see what's going to go go down. Uh, okay. And then, uh, Carla. God damn it. Why did it have to be Mizora? I know. Why did it have to be Zarya? I know. We're supposed to risk our next to get one of her assets. What if it's a runaway like me? Or something far worse? Well, we'll figure it out then. <laughs> we'll figure it out once we find them. Um, you heard Mizora. This is the last thing Will has to do for her. Then he's free. After that, Will sac after what Will sacrifice to save you, it's time to repay the favor. If we don't help, Mizora will turn Will into a Limur or whatever the fuck. Could you live with that? Um, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Uh, I kind of want to just see what she thinks about this, to be honest. If we don't help, like, Will's gonna die. Look, Will's happiness is my happiness. Aww. I'd sooner see myself a Lemia than him. Oh, It's a bad idea to play games with the devil. <laughs> you never win. Not ever. It's okay, we'll figure it out. Aw, you guys. I love how close everyone is. The more bullshit she pours, the more of it I'm forced to swallow. Mazora set me on fiends inside and outside the hells. She's never ordered a rescue. Gods. She makes a mockery of everything the blade stands for. Such an asshole. Arthur. She'll be gone soon enough. Do this mission and Mazora will free you from the pact. Uh, it's not like you have a choice. Do the mission or rotten hells. I thought you were supposed to hunt devils. Doesn't this violate your contract? Um, any idea who this devil is that she needs freeing, or that needs freeing? Not a one. All that matters is that we free it. Fail. And I made a mindless blob clawing at demons on the front lines of the blood. Oh. Okay, it's not going to happen. You mean too much to the Sword Coast. Uh, that's horrifying. I'm so sorry. So you're bound to be a Lemur, no matter what. Um, you are everything you accuse Karlak of being. I'm not sorry for you. Why is it? Why? Why would I say that? Um... So you're bound to be that no matter what? Yes. Unless Mazora actually fulfills her promise and sets me free. I always knew what my future held. And I know I chose right. <clears throat> Thank you for sticking your neck out for me. I mean it. Yes. But I'm not going to celebrate till I'm actually free. I can feel Mazora scheming, plotting. She won't let me go without making a fuss. Trust me on that. <sighs> we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. It's fine. Okay. And then we're going to talk to everyone. The shadow curse. It doesn't seem to affect me like it does others. Not as badly, at least. Do you know what this means? I must be blessed. Lady Shah is protecting me where others are left to face her wrath. Maybe. She loves me. She must do. Maybe. <laughs> what about me? Don't get carried away. This could be something else. So what does all this mean? But what about me? What is that? What, what about me? What? I don't know what that question is asking, actually. So what does all this mean? Lady Shah wouldn't bless me like this for no reason. There must be something she wants of me. Those signs we found about Dark Justicias. Perhaps they were no coincidence. In either case, I need to watch for any place dedicated to Lady Shah. A temple, perhaps. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. We'll keep an eye out. I've never seen such a concentration of shadow magic. We must forge on, but carefully. It will corrupt any who lack the power to control it. Okay, cool. Um, what would it do to me? You're a wizard. Shouldn't you be able to control it? Uh, you know me. I'm nothing... If not exceedingly cautious. I recognize shadow magic when I see it. You needed to explain this to me. <laughs> Stop mansplaining magic to me, Gail. Okay. You know me. I'm nothing if not exceedingly cautious. 
sarcasm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I suspect we define the word differently, but nonetheless, <laughs> this is a place where it's best applied. It. This magic is dangerous. <laughs> it is the very antithesis of all the weave stands for. A magic of confusion and corruption, drawn forth only by those desperate or damned enough to accept its degradations. Okay. Followers of Mistra, those who call on the true weave, are expressly forbidden to indulge it. Okay. I thought Mistra was the god of all magic. Why forbid this? Could you use it yourself? Mistra's loathing of such magic is well founded. It taints everything it touches. Are you still bound by Mistra's doctrine? Um, could you use it yourself? Uh, are you still bound by Mistra's doctrine? Ah, ha, ha, ha. ah, what an interesting question. Yeah, what's your answer, huh? Her doctrine <laughs> is more than just a personal opinion. It forms the very essence of wizardry. I mean, no rush to discard it. Technically, of course I could dabble in such practices. I've yet to find a form of magic I'm not a born natural in wielding. As Just flip your own hair, why don't you? should wield it. I would rather depend on the circumstances and how closely I felt Mistra was watching. But could now, you? I think it's time we moved on to lighter subjects, mm. for we too are lost to the darkness. Was there anything else? Hmm. Is Mistra always such a demanding goddess? Uh, we'll talk about it later. Uh, we'll talk about that later. Okay. Or maybe the start of the next stream. I sought to reach a Githyanki crash and be rid of these tadpoles. Now we stalk forgotten lands haunted by darkness. Okay. That's it? Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Uh, let's... I think we should talk to Halson and see if he has anything new to say. What are you doing? What are you... What are you whittling? What are you making? You wish to speak? Uh, no, I don't. Okay, bye. Um, okay, that's where we'll stop today. Did I miss anyone? I don't think so.